My name is Bill Arnold. I work on BMWs. So I race BMWs. Bill Arnold is flat out the old Bavaria. That's pretty much what I do. This is Work in Progress, where we chronicle enthusiasts building and driving their classic BMWs, Minis, and Rolls Royces. I'm your host, Jason Camisa. In this episode of Work in Progress, we meet Bill and his 1994 325IS, which he's turning into a race car. It's scheduled to compete in the world-famous 24 Hours of Lemons, an endurance racing series for $500 cars. $500 doesn't buy you a pretty car. It's beautiful. I mean, it's stunning in its state of destruction. <laughs> exactly. I mean, it's basically, it's a $500 car with a... Um, $2,500 roll cage. Very cool. And obviously it's going to need... An engine. Uh, a and a kid I was talking kidney, kidney. grill. Wow. <laughs> um, but an engine <laughs> transmission. <laughs> last. Are, are they necessary in lemons racing? Nope. Okay, didn't think so. The worse the better. The worse the better. <laughs> so, it's almost too nice. Well, I have a feeling knowing lemons racing, it's not going to stay nice for long. Mm. Uh, but I also have a feeling it's going to have a lot of power and a lot of suspension and all the things that you do magically to cars to make them. All the leftover bits I have lying around from building other people's race cars. So, when okay. I upgraded their cars, I kept the old parts. Okay, so what, what's going in there? What's the plan? It's going in there. Uh, there's an old Bilstein suspension kit that I pulled off another race car. Mm -hmm. uh, as far as an engine, I've got a motor from a 528i that was relatively fresh. Mm -hmm. And... Same thing with the transmission. Drive shaft is a used one. So E39. Yeah, E39. <laughs> and all E39 engine, but then stock E36 transmission, and just yep. kind of all, and it's all robust enough to race on the track. And it, yeah. And then these cars survive 24-hour endurance races. I mean, these yes. in, this isn't like a 10-minute like scuffle. No. It's it's a 24-hour race. Yep. Um, okay, so. We have, you have two and a half months or two months or something until the next race. A couple months, yeah. Um, and that's going to be done. Mm, it's the plan. <laughs> Do things ever go to plan, plan? ever? Uh, in lemons racing? Okay. Occasionally, yes, okay. they do. That's interesting. I'm so. very curious to see uh, that junk, what is effectively a junkyard car. Literally, rescued, was, it was literally, a pick and pull. Um, rescued from the junkyard, yes. turned into a race car, and then hopefully go and win. I mean, if it's, if it's anything like your E28 is, we have a good shot of seeing this car on a podium. It is possible. Um, yes. So we will come back in a little while and check on you to make sure you're up to no good and making a lot of progress on your car. Um, and in the meantime, if you click on the link below, you can visit the BMW Group Classic blog and check out other cool stories on old cars. On the next episode of Work in Progress, we meet Nick Upton, who's turning a bare shell into a Concours quality Cooper S wagon that Mini never made.